First book, audio recording, test, Spiral War on Dagger's Wings, book one of the Spiral War Saga by S.F. Edwards, read by S.F. Edwards. UCSB date 781.377, star system, Smegris, debris field. In space, silence means death. In a spacesuit or on a ship with the air processor delivers a constant whine, if it stops, you have little time to make your peace. Wearing a spacesuit inside a dead ship, the hum of the air processors all but screams. My suit's link crackled as I approached the heart of the wreckage I'd been sent to investigate. I floated through what only three cycles earlier had been an alien cruiser. Now it was nothing but burnt and twisted metal. Little of the ship's original configuration was identifiable. The interference increased in strength as I pressed further into the shattered ship. Something was still on and transmitting. I hoped it was a communication station. At what appeared to be a junction in the ship's corridor, I found another body. Like the others I'd encountered since boarding, it too was burnt beyond recognition. The hominid form was nearly six metra tall. As I looked closer, I made out a patch on the shoulder. I moved in, embracing myself against the bulkhead, reached out to grab for the scorched cloth. The symbol was foreign to me. The round patch was gray with a gold border. Four symbols. A fat golden rocket, a tree, then some vine and a bolt of lightning surrounded a 12-pointed white starburst within a black diamond. Beneath it were letters, Galactic Federation. The script was similar enough to Confederation Standard that I wondered if we'd had any contact with the race before. It could very well be, be, be that the ancients had passed the seeds of language to them as they had done to so many other seeds, other confed races. That should make things easier once we figure out exactly what's happening here. What went wrong? My link buzzed. Any luck finding that transmitter? I'm getting closer, Tomer, but nothing yet. How about you? I think I found the bridge. Odd placement. It's up against the outer hull. You won't believe this. It even has viewports. I shook my head. This race must be new to space warfare. If they place the bridge in such a vulnerable position. What make you th makes you think it's the bridge? Found a variety of what appear to be control panels... There are also several bodies of varying species. Oh, and there's a captain chair here that reads Captain. I shook my head. Tomer had a bad habit of parsing out details. How many species total? I asked, pushing off to the hatch at the other end of the passageway. The ship's passage and the design confirmed that they used some form of artificial gravity. That was consistent with the readings the attack squadron had taken, indicating the ship was equipped with graviton spinners. If they used gravity plating, then I would still be able to walk through the mess. Um, 